Gotham is a nickname for New York City and the name of a fictional comic book city. The name was originally used by writer Washington Irving to poke fun at the people and culture of the city, but the term eventually stuck regardless. Not only was Thomas Jefferson the third president of the United States, but he was also an architect. He designed his own residence on a 5,000-acre estate called Monticello. The home is designed in the neoclassical style. Stone and brick are durable, load-bearing materials. They've held buildings up for thousands of years, but less so in today's practice. Today, architects and builders use brick and stone veneer like makeup or wigs and hide the structure on the inside. The term dimensional lumber is used to describe typical framing boards used by contractors to build structures. Carpenters use the term nominal size to describe the approximate dimension of boards like a 1x6 or a 2x10. An exterior door serves as the passage in and out of a building. And doors are also a lot like a facial expression or a handshake. The size, materials, color, and age say a lot about a place. The architect deals with a wide array of fields and subject matter in his or her job. These include philosophy, sociology, psychology, material science, engineering, mathematics, history, and construction. In the past, a 2x4 piece of lumber was actually 2 inches by 4 inches. Today, lumber is milled and planed for consistency and appearance. So a 2x4 actually measures 1.5 inches by 3.5 inches. 